Jurgen Klopp is not one of the greatest coaches uh, uh, for nothing, you know, because in addition to his soccer knowledge, he's also an excellent leader. Maybe this later ability or this latter ability is even more important than the first. Hi everyone, yesterday I saw a YouTube video with interview clips of Jurgen Klopp, the German success coach of Liverpool FC and formerly, formerly Borussia Dortmund and Mainz 05. My name is Armin Rau, founder of A. Leonard Rau, the entrepreneur's entrepreneur, entrepreneur, executive and coach for over 20 years. It was amazing for me what you can learn from a soccer coach or football coach as a startup entrepreneur or manager. That's why I decided to make this video to explain to you how the success pr uh, principles of Kloppo, as he is also called in the scene, can be applied in the leadership of your team. If you don't want to miss any of my videos on leadership for entrepreneurs and young professionals, subscribe to my channel by clicking on the red button underneath and don't forget to switch on the bell to always be informed about newest content. So here they are the big five, Kloppo's big five, and what they mean for you. Number one, let them play, let them play. Klopp lets players who are new to the club play the way they want, so he sees exactly how they behave naturally and has the opportunity to learn from them or to incorporate elements that he would not have seen otherwise into his own uh, approach. This means for you, don't explain too much to new members of your team at the beginning. Leave them alone. See how they solve problems and deal with colleagues. That's what they need to develop optimally. Number two, I am the reserve tank. This is how Klopp sees himself as the trainer or the coach at the edge of the playing field. He says that his additional power is good for the team when their forces are dwindling. This means for you, also be the reserve tank of your team. Be there when they need you, don't know what to do or just want to talk. Number three, imagine the spectators in their living rooms. Klopp says that his team plays for the fans and they give everything uh, for them, so they must give everything for the fans. They should do everything together to satisfy the spectators. That means for you, you must satisfy your customers, do everything, see it as your duty to give 100% for the customer. Just like Gloppo's team does this by giving everything for the spectators in the stadium and in the living room. Number four, create memorable experiences. Klopp says that he always wants to create something special with his team in matches and other experience. That means uh, for the team and the spectators. The question is how can they create, how can they run such a show? What is the best way to do this? Do you know what is the best thing for me? When it is when former employees remember what I said, what I created in the past. I love it when they can even quote me after many, many years. Create a special atmosphere, special rights, special approaches. That way you will make a lasting difference with you and for you and with your team. Number five, give your people the expert space. This means that you have to have people around you who know more than you take care of their opinion, take them on board and base your decisions on them. That is also very important uh, for your success but also for their motivation. The more experts you've got around you, the better your success will be. If you take them seriously, your success will grow and this of course will also increase the chances of you know, economic success. Jurgen Klopp is not one of the greatest coaches uh, uh, for nothing, you know, because in addition to his soccer knowledge, he's also an excellent leader. Maybe this later ability or this latter ability is even more important than the first. Apply the above five rules and you will immediately improve your leadership and performance of yourself and your team, as well as the probability of survival for your business. I invite you to look for more videos of great leaders in my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. See you next week and don't forget, lead yourself.
Thanks for watching. If you liked this video, go check out some of my other videos on Leadership for Entrepreneurs and don't forget to subscribe by clicking on the red button and click on the bell too. If you are interested in a chat with me, you can find my contact details underneath this video and we can have a chat about one of your specific leadership challenges together. Just click and apply. My life program is tailored to young leaders and entrepreneurs trying to grow from founders into leaders.